Hi everyone and welcome to Miss Estric Biology and this video is dedicated to all of my amazing year 13s and year 14s who have just finished their exams. Congratulations on completing your A-levels. You must feel like you are free as a bird right now. I know how tough exam season can be so you've done so well to make it through so you can now relax and enjoy a well-earned break. Now before you go and do the virtual equivalent of burning all your notes and getting rid of every textbook you've ever had, which is the unsubscribe, unfollow, I want to just let you know what I have coming up for you and why it's not time for you to say goodbye to me just yet. So let me share the special series I'm going to be running on YouTube all throughout the summer just for you. This summer will probably be one of the best summers of your life because you don't have any exams to prepare for. But I know that when we get towards August, something big is gonna be happening, which you are gonna want some help and advice on. So I'm gonna be doing a series on results day, how to prepare for it, what to expect, what is clearing, how to make the most of clearing. So around the middle of August, look out for that. I'm gonna be there to help you for results day. For those of you heading off to university, I've got you covered. I'm gonna be doing videos talking you through how to prepare for that big move Move to university. Whether that is you are leaving home, I'm going to have top tips on what to pack and what to prepare for. Or even if you're not leaving home, what to expect from university to make sure that big jump from being an A-level student to a university student isn't quite as daunting. And lastly, I'm going to be going through a series of what content from A-level biology commonly comes up in first year for medics, dentistry students, biology students, biomedical students, basically anything where biology is involved because there are some A-level topics that they reteach or slightly more advanced versions they reteach to make sure that every student is at the same level in first year. So I'm going to talk you through all of that so when you do get to university you can be fully confident that you've already already got a head start, you know what you're doing and you can be confident in your ability. So stick around for all of that advice and help that I have lined up for you to make sure that yes you can enjoy this amazing summer but also you are ready for the next big step in your journey. If there's anything else that you want help with preparing for that I haven't mentioned, drop it in the comments. I'm here to make this series for you so let me know what you'd like to see to get ready for. But for now I'm going to give you at least a week to recover. I'm also going to take a break because exam season's intense for me as well and I'll be back here in a week or two on YouTube to start helping you out.